Started also against Arsenal there. Junior Firpo, who's arrived from Real Betis, makes his Barcelona bow here. Ricky Puig and Carlos Perez keep their places with Luis Suarez and the aforementioned Antoine Real Betis and Elche. There's Wage, Musa Wage of Senegal. Played only a bit part during the... Uh, Really hit the target. On the other hand, Jerry, it is pre season, and when you've got what 16, 18, and 28 Serie A goals in the last three yeah. seasons, you're probably entitled to have one. No, of them. no, he's class and, and he sees things that other strikers don't. That's why I was singing his praises. I do feel that uh, he's a type of player with a target man that if the, the surface is good, he'll score you goals, and he's proven that in the last three seasons. Getting on now, what is he, 32? Yes, 32, but. Um, Interesting, looking at the, the young he's on the left-hand side, but he's a right-footed playing on the left wing, so he's going to be cutting inside to shoot a goal. And again, he's only 21 years old, under 17 Spanish international. So Spectacular concept, this, I must say, and the crowd have really bought into it here in Miami, Jerry. La Liga and Syria are working together to promote, the, to promote their wares. Good idea. Absolutely. You know, and two of, two of the bigger teams as well, the show won the treble once, you know, and that was quite a few years ago when they had an incredible team but they expect to win the treble every year and they got beaten in the Copa del Rey final they've won the Copa del Rey more than any other club in Spanish football and Real Madrid I think have been beaten more times than any other club in Spanish football and Atleti Bilbao funny enough for the second team to have uh, the, the, the best record in the Copa del Rey but those are the there's three teams who have never been relegated from La Liga and it's Barcelona Real Madrid and Atleti Bilbao Always a pressure on, and I listened to PK doing his conference earlier, Paul, and PK was saying... Busquets. Fabian Ruiz tried to trick him once more. Players want to play from Paul, he is top man. I don't know, it's a, it's a debating point. Then he uh, deferred to Busquets, really, that was a case of a younger boy getting out of the way for the senior man. They start games they get under their belt playing in the first team, the better it is for them. And here's one of them, the young Sen Senegalese, he's looking to get forward. Oh, that was not oh. very nice, was it? Wagu hit the ball, his first touch was good, his second touch was really poor. And uh, he's gone in. A slightly late here, you can see. And it's gone slightly over the top. Jerry, you would well know that that... And the referee having a quiet word with him. And I think he's right too as well. Liverpool have suffered in pre-season in this respect as well. That could have been nasty. Very damaging. Yeah, it could have been. Incidentally, among the subs here for Napoli, I've said over the last two or three seasons because of the stadium, now they're in a position that they can and should. I know they're still chasing Lo Celso from Real Betis and I think that's been done I think that's just about Steve down the side to Perez Perez got a, doesn't matter who's wearing the Blaugrana jersey you know, they've got some talent there haven't they this is good Wagay rotations like the Copa del Rey Irony there, of course, at Valencia. He was not in Miami. Um, they're probably used to it more in Spain, and it, it can get really hot up there. They're not having a great preseason. They've conceded a lot of goals, 16 goals in four games, averaging four goals against. And uh, they need to get it sorted out quickly. That's good skills. In a sense, this is a sort of Barcelona B in many ways at the moment. The senior men last. Few remaining links, Jerry, with that glorious side you spoke about six, seven years ago now. Wage sits it up, but that was all. Merritt with an easy, easy... Angle-wise, it was good. Maybe a little bit too much pace on it for Wage, who couldn't take a chance to take a touch. He had to hit it first time, and it was too close to the goalkeeper, and an easy to was Suarez. So my favourite player for Barcelona has already gone. Andres Iniesta. I'm sticking with Xavi, incidentally. <laughs> Xavi was class, and he retired long before in Andres Iniesta. But that was some midfield, they just, they controlled the ring, I remember them playing Manchester United now. Chávez found a little bit of room again, here's Wagge. 
crowd got excited, but it wasn't a tester. A spluttering Barcelona were watching at the moment. Left foot, Wage, and not a great header from Rakitic. Play their way out, which is admirable, but if you lose possession, they've seen a couple now that have been debatable. It's the kind of practice match you used to love, isn't it? Where we don't have offsides today, boys. Yeah, but the challenges were a lot stronger, I have to tell you. Were you surprised when Barcelona decided to go very for it? well? He has his head up all the time. He's looking for passes. He's very intelligent for a 19-year-old. He looks like he could be a very promising player. Wage. Suarez. Wage shows some enterprise from right back. Well, the crowd got excited. Merritt just left it. Well, it wasn't bad, I have to say. And uh, Sergio Roberto, who normally plays at right back, or Semedo, they'll be the two who are very accomplished players. You know, Sergio Roberto asked the question. It's happened two or three times. He said at least half of these players won't play the opening game of the season. Well, they've got, they've got to earn their right, haven't they? And they're at the start of their careers in many cases, and it won't be easy. Oh, grip. Oh, <laughs> Wage sliding in again, as he did early in the first half. He's very robust, and the referee going to have a word with him. You know, he caught Mario Rui again. Yeah. Yellow carded this time. I thought the first one should have been a yellow, Jerry, just to yeah. calm him down. Yeah, but see when he goes in. He comes in, and it's his trailing leg I think he catches him with. This left foot. Tell us, Jerry. In your, in your opinion, was that? Challenge. I think he got booked because he's made two similar challenges, and that's why he's got the, the yellow card. Baguette. But, you know, he's 100%. And it, it, his commitment, I love. I love that type of commitment from a player. But that was maybe 10 or 15 years ago, you would have got away with that, but not now. You know, not in these circumstances. It's a good looking ball. Simovic was cool, but there's a time for Wage to line it up on the edge of the box. Syria goals from Insigne last season. Not quite at the level of 16 17 when he got 18. But a quality player. Wage. Good move by Rafinha again. Rakitic. Here is Rafinha. high wide and none too handsome angle was tight for Waga to be fair he might have been offside you can see here Busquets finds the pass or it's Rakitic finds the pass Rafinha's shot's partially blocked that's a tight decision and he doesn't hit the target Waga to Rafinha This time. Well, they're rigging the changes, aren't they? 25 minutes of the game. 25 million purchase from Ajax. 